2K Sports welcomes you to the following presentation of the NBA. tonight, Chris Webber and Greg Anthony with our Hall of Famer, David Aldridge, reporting from the sideline. D.A., take it away. Thank you, Kevin. Marcus Smart stands six foot three, but he said, I can guard bigs, so I started making a joke. I'm a stretch six. Forget a stretch five. My teammates loved it, and it just stuck with me. He added, I'm the youngest of four boys, so I've been up against bigger guys. For me, that means nothing. Kevin? <laughs> Stretch six. I love that. Great stuff, David. Thank you. So here is Miami's starting group. Round out there with Smith. Then it's Butler. And then there's Precious Achua. And it's Adebayo in at the center, locking down the middle. And for the Celtics. Out in the front court along with Tatum. Payne out there with Marcus Smart. And it's Williams at the five. Taking a look at Boston. They already find themselves, Greg, in a must-win situation. Dropping game one was a shock to their players, the coaches, and certainly the fans. Truth is, a few teams have come back for an 0-2 deficit at home. And yes, it is rare. Mm -hmm. Expect them, though, to come out tonight with purpose, with a fire in their bellies. They know they can't leave anything out there on the floor tonight. I'm looking at you. You've got a fire in your belly, don't you? Yes. I'm roaring and ready to go. Now here's Smart. Brown wide open. He fired. Good, and Smart gets the assist. Brown's got the first bucket of the night. A three-pointer for Boston. Smith dishes the bubble. Williams with the block. A main staple in Williams' game. That sixth sense for when to rise up and deter those shots. Here's Miami now. It's a three-point game. Cotobio with the bucket. Man, they tailored their offense around him. And let me tell you, he loves playing in the system. And just over a minute played here in the start of the game. Here's Payne. Here's Smart. And the three off target. Up top, out of Iowa. He's guarded by Williams. Smith outside. Kicks to Butler. Six to shoot. On deep. The offensive rebound. Back to Smith. Loads it up for Butler, trying to go for an alley-oop, but excellent defense and anticipation there to stop. There's the triple. Miami grabs the miss. They won in their last outing, Saturday's game. And that was not an easy game for them. I mean, they barely hung on at the end of regulation before they were able to pull it out. They got that little burst of energy shooting the extra period. Once they survived regulation, they were not going to let this go. Lock it four. And shot opportunity. Achua, no good. It's a very aggressive defense to prevent the easy lane. Pass to Brown. If you're just tuning in, we played about two and a half minutes here in the first. 
Mr. Smart. Shoots over Brown. Again, the miss by the Celtics. They're struggling here. They're up one for five now. The D has them bottled up so far. Here's Smith. Williams with the block. And it's out of bounds. They say it was last touch by Williams. His shot was hindered by that momentous mobile one block. And that block was something. It's the playoffs, and every possession and defensive stop matters. against but Smith outside five to shoot and it's out of bounds and he's able to retain possession here Ball. And here in the first, uh, about three minutes in, gets it to go. That one good from Autobio. Precious Achua. It's Payne with the ball. He'll bring it up for the Celtics. And now the first timeout called here for Boston. Trying to find some answers offensively. Some bad shot selection as well as some bad luck. I mean, that's not going to help you score points. Fans, the longest section gets free T-shirt. Let's see who gets the longest and who wants a T-shirt. Tatum. It's stolen by Smith. It's Brown on the win. Back to Smith. Passes it to Autobio. Here's Butler. Oh, and the jam by Butler. And what can Autobio do? I mean, he gets the tough rebound, scores the tough baskets and then makes the right pass. Now here's Williams. Still looking for his first bucket in this one. Here's Tatum. And the dunk by Tatum. And the one hand slam just looks so pretty when it's in his hand and he's the one doing the slam. Agreed. He is smooth as silk. Even on a power finish. And the foul called on Cameron G. That is his first foul of the game. First two foul. with it back to Brown beautiful dish and the layup goes down well this is what Smith does best keeping his eyes moving to set up the open Payne passes to Williams outside Tatum jacks up a three trains it from beyond the arc Tatum's got seven points in the game now Smith Brown outside. Here's Autobio. And the Heat get another bucket right there. And inside is where Bam is at his best. He knows how to outwork the other guys in the paint. Now here's Payne, covered by Smith. Payne passes to Tatum. Oh, that's blocked. 
And here we go. It's Butler. And he lobs it up toward the rim. Well, I think Jimmy Buckets has underrated this. He's more than capable of spotting open teammates and distributing the court. It's Williams high post. Outside, smart. Now here's Payne. Still getting warmed up offensively. No scoring yet from him. Ball's not loose. Butler with the steal. Brown against Smith. The pass to Autobio. Rebounded by the Celtics. And, and typically he has the touch to finish when he's in tight, but not sure on that possession. And there's Brown. That's good on the assist from Smart. Brown's got his second basket. And Brown is superb at just keeping focus. Despite what the D throws at him, he has the job done. And the first time out of the game called for the Heat. Adjustments are a part of the game, and the coach sees something he doesn't like here. Yeah, I, I like the chess match that's going on here. Each team trying to find and, and exploit the favorable matchup. Substitution. And a new group in for the Heat. Thaddeus Young. He's checked in for Bam Adebayo. Hood comes in for Achua. Mann's checked in for Jimmy Butler. And it's Tyler Hero in for Smith. Now, Hero can't hit the turnaround jumper. Oh, he did everything right there except hit the shot. Now, here's Payne. He's covered by Hero. Pass to Mann. Here's Hood. And the call on the shot sends him to the line. That's his second personal foul. Second team foul. The Heat shooting their first shot to the night from the charity strike. Taking two shots. And the first one drops. Wayne Ellington's checked in for the Celtics. So he's able to get one of two. They've been beating them to a lot of those loose balls and rebounds here to start. Yeah, way to play in attack mode and get to the line. He's first. Personal foul. First team foul. And a chance for just a second now to check out the scoring breakdown for Miami. They've carried out a great game plan in the paint so far. Working it down low a lot and getting high percentage looks. And also another aspect of their game that's been super so far tonight is how they've been sharing the basketball. Good on the second free throw. And here is Brown. To the middle. And it's blocked by Brown. Brown lights up. And finished off by Brown. You gotta love how Brown finishes strong, driving fast and hard to the cup for the rim rocking just here. Here's Hero. He's gotten some minutes, but nothing on the board yet. Brown feeling out of it. The kick out to Young. Out of bounds, Boston takes possession. They like to beat through that pass. Bad way to lose a possession. Now here's Ellington. He's covered by Hero. Ellington dishes to Brown. Pass to Neesmith. They kick out to Brown. Shot clock at six. And then Brown with the dunk. What you love about Brown's game right now, he understands the offense, and he understands his role within it. Brown outside. Passes it to man. And here is Hero. He's now 
one for two with that bucket. Hero. And how about Harrell's body control, capable of still scoring even when the defense ups the ante in terms of physicality. Now, here's Ellington. Two minutes remaining in the first. There's the pass. Here's the three. That shot off. Now the Heat take it the other way. It's Brown with the drive. Second foul. Aaron Neesman. That's his first personal foul. Third team foul. The Heat have gone one for two on the night so far from the line. Two shots. One falls for him. Now Horford's checked in for Brown. And Brown drops them both. Boston's gone two of five from three point land here in the first quarter. Ellington, the basketball. Faden, goodbye, Hood, and it goes down two points. Faden's got it all tied up now for Boston. Pretty much all of their buckets coming from inside the paint now. Brown outside. Oh, and there's the alley oop. Throws down the alley oop slam. Oh, such a beautiful pass to set that one up. Yeah, the pass might have been pretty, but the finish was angry. <laughs> <laughs> now, here's Ellington. Nothing yet on the scoreboard for him. A nice shot by Newsmith. Guys, no one team gaining control early on. Yeah, you look at the lead changes. Six already. 51 seconds left to play here in the first. Here's Brown. Goes back up, and he lays it up and in. Brown. Brown's got six points. And we've seen several lead changes tonight. Neither team giving an inch. It's a seesaw battle. Both teams are pretty evenly matched, and the score reflects that. Here's Horford. Played in with a nice touch off the ball. Horford. It's never easy to stop Horford. I mean, mainly because he's so strong and able to shrug off the deep. Eight-second difference between the shot clock and the game clock. Brown outside. Stolen away. Nice job to interrupt the alley-oop attempt there. Brown right side. And then Brown with the dunk. And the determination of Brown is phenomenal. No one is going to stop these shots from going down. Defensive foul. Bruce Brown. First trip to the free throw line for him tonight. Personal foul. Second team foul. At the line for your Celtics. Jalen Brown at the line with one shot. Free throw good from Brown. A player who does special things off the floor. Jalen Brown is an amazing role model for young kids. Very active on speaking about the importance of education and learning new languages himself. Hero with it. Just three on the clock. Doesn't go for him. Jalen Brown has been leading the charge for Boston. He got into double digits for the quarter with 10 points total. Don't go anywhere. We'll be right back. And you talk to Jimmy Butler. His confidence in this Miami team, Greg, is at an extremely high level. I mean, listen to his words. We got a team full of guys that can score, a team full of guys that can defend, can get everybody else involved. Um, it's, a, it's a nice team, man. We're playing well. You talk about scoring and defending and playmaking. Greg, Jimmy Butler can do all three. Yeah, leading the way with his play, he's made a huge difference ever since he joined the team. And glad to have you with us as we get going here in game two. 
And what do you guys think about Boston here in this one? An impressive start. They came in with a well conceived game plan and have executed. Yeah, this is their preferred yeah, pace. I mean, it's got the opposite early lead. First team ball. They've got Horford. Neesmith is out there four, with Wayne Ellington. Then there's Jalen Brown. That's the Boston One Five. Two. The first free throw is good. It's also good, so he hits both free throws. Here's Neesmith. He dishes it to Horford. He kicks it to Ellington. Floats it up for Horford. And pulls out with that assist. Nice delivery there in traffic. The Heat trail by four. Brown with the bounce pass. Feeds to Hood. The jump hook. Bank shot. No good. Austin's gone three to six tonight when they've let it fly from downtown. Good on the bucket. Hood's got five now. Well, that's not the kind of interior defense you want. Way too slow to protect the run. Neesmith, the pass to Brock. Now, here's Neesmith. Back to Ellington. Pocket six. Over Young. Kept alive. Well, we've seen that movie a few times. That was an easy bucket in the paint. And we're a little over a minute and a half into the second quarter of action. Now Hero. Young looking around. Jalen Brown with the rebound. Celtics leading by four. Now here's Ellington. Brown outside. The Celtics need to get a shot off. Here's Neesmith. That one wide left. The Heat trail by four. For those of you just joining us, we're almost two and a half minutes into the second quarter. Hero, the shot, no good. So the Celtics will take it the other way. To the wing right side. Brown outside. From the arc. That one, no good. And here's Brown. He'll bring it up for the Miami Heat. Pass to Hero. Back to Brown. Horford with the rebound. Celtics have gone two of five in the field here in the second quarter, shooting 40%. And there's the foul. Here we go on Terrence Main. That's his first foul. Some changes for Boston. Mason Tatum comes in for Jalen Brown. And Marcus Smart is subbed in for Wayne Ellington. The Heat also changing it up. Adebayo is checked in for Young. And it's Butler in for Bruce Brown. Now here's Smart. No points in the game yet for him. Got a piece of it. And out of bounds as the Heat gain possession. Williams is checked in for the Celtics. Payne comes in for Neesmith. And then for Miami, Achua comes in for Hood. And it's Ish Smith in for Terrence Mann. Smith against Smart. Now, Hero. He's guarded closely. Pass to Autobio. Double team on Autobio. Hero kicks to Smith. Just five on the clock. To the inside. And it goes out of bounds. That one is off Smith. Oh, come on, fellas. Keep your head in the game. I mean, that pass should have been basic. And just over three and a half minutes played here in the second quarter. Horford high post. 
Smith against Tatum. Three pointer. That's good, and it's his fourth basket of the game. He's a strong four for six. Nice job setting up for that shot. Working together for Tatum. Smith, the pass to Butler. Williams with the steal. It's three on three on the fast break. Right side smart. Shoots over Hero. Hits the front of the rim and out. I like what he was trying to do. Shaking the D with the fadeaway. Tough look. Pass to Smith. The pass to Hero. Yes, and it's Smith with the assist that time. Hero's got five now. Oh, a dead-eye shooter. Hero is always ready to snipe it off the feed. Payne finds Williams. Here's Horford. Outside, smart. Shot clock at five. Williams passes to Horford. Now here's Tatum, covered by a chew. Got a hand on it. And here is Hero. He's got five. And foul on the shot, so he'll get a chance at the line. That one on Horford. And this guy is a gamer. Hero embraces any chance he can to draw a foul Hero while taking a shot. as a rookie scoring 16 points per game in the playoffs a huge reason Miami reached the finals Brown is checked in for Al Horford both good from the line that time we are having a lot of success from the line here in the second quarter Payne passes to Williams. Here's Tatum, defended by Butler. And contact on the shot, so he'll be shooting free throws here. That's his first. Again, the footwork, the positioning. Tatum's a difficult cover inside. Hey guys, what do you think about the offensive approach we've seen so far for the Celtics? Well, they're just a team in sync right now. Their passing in the first half has been outstanding. And also defensively, they've been able to cause Take some break. turnovers Take tonight. And, and that also builds confidence and gives you momentum. And that one falls for Tatum. And of course, the Celtics traded back from number one to number three to draft Tatum in terms of readiness and absolute stick. Second free throw, no good. The Heat trail by three. Adebayo kicks to Smith. Pass to Butler. Out to Smith. Williams with the block. Here's Payne driving the lane. Good, and it's Tatum picking up the assist. And the Celtics lead by five. Here's Smith. He's been patient so far. Nothing on the scoreboard yet. Pass to Hero. Back to Smith. Tobio down low. Bain covering. Smith outside. Nailed from three-point land. Smith's got his first three points of the game. This is the one area Smith must continue to work on. I love seeing him knock down the three ball, expanding his range. Payne up top. He's guarded by Adebayo. Smart on the wing. 
Shot clock at six. Smith with the defensive effort. And so it's Smith with it. He'll bring it up for the Miami Heat. Trailing by two. Adebayo with the bucket. Man, you see the offense coming around for Adebayo. Entered the league with raw skills, but he's had the benefit of great coaching. Now here's Payne. Here's Tatum. And he gets the basket. Officials blowing the whistle, so a chance at the line for one more. His individual effort has been outstanding tonight, and it's helped him grab the lead. The Celtics shoot their sixth attempt at the charity stripe in the game. Personal foul. Third team foul. At the line for the Celtics. Jason Tatum the at the line, the shooting one. And that one falls for Tatum. Well, finally, he's getting himself to the line. He's gotten much more aggressive as the game's going on. Now, here is Smith. Bain covering to the paint. Here's Butler. That's in coming off Jimmy. an assist from Adebayo. Adebayo's got four assists in the game. Uh, these type of buckets fuel Butler. He welcomes the challenge of outworking the defense. Now, here's Williams. He's still scoreless so far in this one. Payne with it outside Tatum. And he's fouled pretty hard on that shot, but he's got the chance to pick up the points at the line. It's going to be on Bam out of bio. Tatum has a good feel for catching defenders off balance. I mean, what he can do at the line. The Celtics have gone four of six so far from the line, missing a couple. Shoot two. And the first one at the line is good. And so Tatum nails them both. Just solid. Really one of the very best there is at the free throw line. Smith surveying the D. Inside, here's Autobio. It's in and he's a very efficient five for six on the game. That's their third straight make off an assist. Boston. Time call here. The Celtics decide to talk it over. here outside smart Tatum on the wing six to shoot six for ten with that shot going in it's a good game for a lot of guys I love Tatum's use of the pick that time the extra room is all you need to take a confident shot outside Butler three pointer on the way great D that time from Tatum Celtics leading by three. Now Payne. Brown outside. Outside Tatum. Fires for three. Scores the bucket. He's seven for 11 and continues to look good. As he put his foot on the pedal here this quarter, he's doing a terrific job in terms of leading their offense. And it's Butler missing. Playing the revenge car right there. Trying to get those three points right back. Two minutes. Oh, the lob is smart. Oh, and they get in the way of the alley -oop. Not to be. Good play defensively. Hero passes to Butler. Drills the three-pointer. Jimmy. Butler's got nine. Uh, a confident spot-up shooter. Butler's what I call instant offense. Bain with the bounce pass. Tatum with it. Now Smith defending. And he gets the button. Tatum's got 23 points. 
And he's starting to show that killer instinct this quarter, looking to extend the lead. Now, here is Smith. Always going up for the alley oop here. And Adebayo throws it down. With strong athleticism, Adebayo can finish just about any lob with his large catch radius. Dane passes to Williams. Now, Tatum, defended by Butler. And Tatum, the bucket on the assist by Williams. Williams has got three assists tonight. Three triples for him this quarter. Four overall. This is it to Adebayo. Wants to get it to Butler and does. Up high to stop the alley-oop. Oh, and the connection Butler has with his teammates, he knows when they're going to throw it his way. The pass to Tatum. 34 seconds left to play here in the second quarter. Shoots over at Chua. Again, the Celtics good for two. And now he's taken a solid opening in the quarter and built on it here in the second. Pass to Autobio. And stolen by Tatum. And here's the break. Here's Payne. Smith with the defensive effort. Oh, and a fast break for the Heat. Butler with the ball. Makes it off the glass. Jimmy. Butler's got nine points in the quarter. Contact doesn't get to Butler often. I mean, he uses his strength to his advantage in these situations. And here's Tatum for three. It doesn't go for him. What a performance for Jason Tatum. He has been the story so far for the Boston Celtics. Going on an absolute rampage, piling in the points. He dictated the pace of the entire quarter. And a chance now to send it over to David Aldridge, standing by courtside. David. Thanks very much. Eric Spolster here with us. A lot of three-pointers allowed in the first half. How do you limit that going forward? Well, there's been some airspace uh, issues. I mean, there are a couple easy ones where we didn't rotate over on the weak side, but we're just not making that extra effort uh, to get to the shooter. And we know multiple effort is a big part of what you do. Thanks, Coach. Back to you guys. All right, David, thank you. And stay with us, folks. We'll be back just after halftime to get the third quarter started. It's the 2K Sports Halftime Show. Taking a look at the Celtics, they've battled hard, not letting their loss in Game 1 affect their performance tonight. But the second half is going to tell the tale of whether they go into Game 3 desperate for a win or with momentum on their side and a 1-1 series tie. And taking a look at the Celtics, Kenny, what did you see out there? They've been knocking it down from three. You have to give the playmakers credit for consistently finding the open guy. And then, of course, the shooters have delivered. If they keep it up, they're going to be tough to beat. Shaq, let's get your insight on Miami. Whatever their game plan was defensively coming in, that needs to change. Can't let a team shoot for a percentage in the high 50s and expect to come out on top. It's on the coaches and the players to adjust. basketball here in round one and you know guys Jason Tatum has really been making it happen the way he was able to finish on the block was incredible there in that first half bringing the physicality I mean they kept working it to him and he kept delivering well it doesn't get much better than playoff basketball let's get back to the action here in round one here's who Eric Spolster is starting the second half with. Smith is out there with Bruce Brown. Then there's a Chua. Then it's Bam Adebayo. And it's Butler in at the small forward. Just five to shoot. Pope loose. Taken away by Williams. Long kicks to Tatum. Williams trying to break free. And they recover. And he gets contact and the whistle on the shot. Two shots coming up. Wow, he got whacked. Oh, that one shouldn't be much debate there.
and he's got his first free throw of the game. Cameron Payne at the line for two shots. First free throw is good. Payne hits them both. The Heat trail by six. Brown outside. Here's Butler trying to get open. Is out of him. And Butler gets it to go on the assist by Brown. And the chemistry has been terrific. Really impressed with their offensive execution. Pass to Tatum. Second half just getting started. About a minute play. And Adebayo sends it back. Butler in the corner. And he overshot that one. Missing. Austin leading by four. Here's Smart. And he banks in the layup. Just too physically smart. Shedding the defense and finishing strong. And it's Smith with the ball. Is it up for Miami? Passing to Achua. Hit the tip. And, and really and keeping the ball oh. hopping around here offensively. For Boston, they've gone one of three since starting the second half. Payne dishes to Brown. Celtics passing it around. Now here's Payne covered by Achua. Six on the shot clock. Down low. Here's Otobio. Misses the weight. Austin's gone six of 12 from outside. A very nice 50% mark. Shooting the three ball well. Well, I love seeing Taylor. Such a motivating performance. Now, here is Smith. Bain covering. Out of bio. Kicks to Smith. The kick outside to Bain. And out of bounds as the Celtics gain possession. Just carelessness there. I mean, you have got to have your head in the game. A tremendous mobile one block that we had to see again. Great send back. And well, they didn't make it this far by giving up easy ones. And now the defense is in overdrive. Young's checked in for a chewer. Just under two and a half minutes into the third quarter now. Payne fires from deep. Again, the miss by the Celtics. The Heat trail by six. Adebayo passes to Smith, and here is Brown. Adebayo kicks to Smith. Up to Adebayo. It's deflected. They recover it. Austin's gone 0-2 from deep to start things here in the second half. Here's Brown. Carries it down low. Brown's got 12 in the game. Uh, I tell you what, Brown is a powerful wing player. You like to give him the ball inside. Smith right side. It's deflected. Here's Tatum. And he can't extend the lead to double digits. His field goal percentage has dipped this quarter. I mean, his movement has to be better. He has to find the open spots on the floor. Smith finds Butler. From downtown, that's in the Celtic lead is cut down to five on the bucket from Smith. Six points for him. Not the biggest fan of that shot, but he had the space to get it off. So, so why not? Here's Tatum. And it's Miami with the rebound. Adebayo's got his sixth rebound on the night. Smith outside. Brown outside. Driving to the basket. Tatum down low. Adebayo on him. Whistle blows. Basket is good. So a chance here for a three-point play. 
And look at how the hustle game has been going for the Celtics. They played a heads up brand for basketball this entire game. And they've got the steal to prove it. And also, I've been extremely impressed with their interior D. Their rim protection has been as good as it gets. Al Horford has checked in for Boston. And then for Miami, Hood comes in for Bam Adebayo. Man subbed in for Buck. Brown outside. Here he goes. Now the pass to Man. A three-pointer off the mark. That's his first personal foul. Celtics making a switch here. Smarts check in. Now we put a lineup for the Celtics. Marcus Smart. Celtics leading by eight. Pass to Brown. To the left wing. Here's Horford. Rebound by the Heat. Here's Mann. Inside. Here's Smith. Count the bucket. And he's got a free throw coming up as well. That weakness of Smith is so hard to keep up with, which is why he's able to get these shots off in time. And he's got his first chance at the line here. Smith. The line for one. He throw good, Smith. The resiliency of Smith is something you have to admire. He's bounced around the league and has finally become a valuable rotation. Yes, Denise Smith. And here is Brown, covered by Smith. Here's Smart. That one doesn't go. And it's Miami the other way. He's lucky his teammates have picked up the slack. I mean, his shooting has been horrific. And here's Smith. Nine points in the game so far. Down to five on the shot clock. Here's Mann. Rebounded by the Celtics. Baden's got his fourth rebound in this one. Here's Smart. Ejected by Young. And they get it back. Brown outside. Takes it inside. And finished off by Brown. Well, you got to love the explosiveness. Brown just eating up any lane to the basket seat. Smart against Smith. Dishes it to Brown. Of the night. When you allow good scores to get uncontested shots at the rim, no, no wonder oh, they you're losing. Yeah, yeah. Horrible effort. It appears they may be on the brink of giving up. Timeout called the Heat. Yeah, things not going their way, and he wants to just try to talk this one over. Defensive intensity has to pick up, and I'm sure coach is going to let them know that. Jason Tatum, he's checked in for the Celtics. Tyler Hero, he's checked in for Miami. Here's Hero. He has seven. Kicks it to Brown. Passes it to Mann. Five on the clock. Knocked away. 
Right wing. Here's Vaden. And he buries that one, trimming the rim on the way down. Vaden's got the lead up to 13 now for Boston. And the pass to Hero. Pass to Man. Buries it from three point range. Man. Man's got five now. Oh, great job moving the rock by Hero. Not a ball stopper. Tyler is a team player. Here's Brown shooting foul as the whistle blows. He'll shoot two free throws. That's his play. How about the body control on that one? Narrowly misses getting the deuce. And this is his second trip to the line tonight. Brown at the line for two. Free throw missing. Oh, pro probably a little draft in the arena tonight. He's the last guy you expect to miss the mark by that much. Absolutely. Celtics making a switch here. Browns checked in. And Miami with a change here, too. Achua's checked in. And he misses the second one as well, so he is 0 for 2 that time. With it. Seven points in the game. Brown outside. Over Tatum. And it's Brown missing. Nice interior defense. Can't give him any space inside a real burn. Tatum finds smart. Celtics passing it around. Brown inside the line. Rebounded by Hood. Hood's got four rebounds in this game. against Tatum. Brown the pass to Manning. Into the lane. Hero. And the baseline jumper no good. He's been cold and it's been hurting him. D, I mean, he's ready for him. He hasn't been able to solve it. And so much for repeating the three-point barrage he put on in the first half. Nothing here in the second. Now, Hero... Blocked by Brown. Outside, smart. It's blocked. Brown against Brown. Feeds it to Hood. Off the mark, had a chance to trim it to single digits. against Brown. 102 left to play in the third. To stop the drought, count that one as his seventh bank in eight attempts. A scorching 88%. Determining Brown seeing it in the how good of an outside shooter can be. For me, that's, that's the only question. But uh, he may have already exceeded expectations. Now, Hero. He has seven. And the foul on Marcus Smart. That's foul number two for him. Yeah, clearly he had an established position there. Payne, he's checked in for Marcus Smart. Autobio is checked in for the Heat. Jimmy Butler comes in for Bruce Brown. There's 42 seconds left in the third. And it's Butler missing. It's Payne with the ball. He'll bring it up for the Boston Celtics. Brown. And then Brown with the dunk. You see the power is building the ball offensively. First it was taking over stretches. And now it's taking over games. Hero passes to Manning. Loads it up for Adebayo. Oh, a nice defensive play to disrupt the alley-oop. In the corner, Tatum with it. With four seconds on the clock, pulled the shot a little bit, but the bounce goes his way. 
Tatum's got 35 in the game. And so it's the Boston Celtics feeling good about their 17-point lead heading into the break. They kept the tempo quick and the defense on its heels, and it's gotten them up big right back after this break. Head coach Eric Spolstra mic'd up along the sideline. Let's check it out. Well, moving the ball is so important to these coaches. I mean, it helps make the offense run smoothly, Kevin. When you move the ball, more scoring opportunities open up. NBA playoffs round one. Thanks for joining us as we get back to the action on the court. All fueled up and ready to go. Let's reset the lineups courtesy of Gatorade for the fourth quarter. On the floor for Boston. Outside, the wings are Brown and Tatum. Bob Williams is out there with Moses Brown. And it's Payne at the point guard position. Look at, look at the big fella working on that possession. He knows how to fend guys off and get those rebounds. Pass to Tatum. Side Williams. Down to five on the shot clock. Here's Brown. Count the basket. Hey, when the size advantage is as big as it was there, I mean, that's exactly what he's supposed to do in that situation. Now, Hero. Bain covering. Caballo down low. Brown on him. Gets it to go. That one good from Autobio. And he just battles hard in the post. Bam doesn't need a clean look to convert from that range. Passes it to Williams. It's hauled in by Achua. Achua's got rebound number seven for him tonight. The shot by Autobio, no good. Celtics leading by 17. Tatum, that's for two. And he sinks that one in the back of the rim on the way in. And that's now 37 points for Jason Tatum. They've been looking out of sync offensively. Yeah, the, their offense has ground to a standstill. That one goes in. Hero in the touch Assist on the interior. Hero Jimmy can hit Butler. jumpers as well as capitalize in close. Bang, looking around. And there's the pass to Williams. Elbow shot. It's hauled in by the Heat. Autobio's got seven rebounds in the game. And good. That's a friendly bounce off the right side of the rim. And the shooting has really been there for him today. But he may have to take it upon himself to continue to carry this team and try and get out of this hole. Payne finds Tatum. And that will be two free throws coming up. Officials on the call with the foul. That's his second personal foul. First team foul. At the line for the Celtics, Jason Tatum. At the line for two shots. The first one falls. Both teams deciding to change it up. And so Tatum nails them both. The Heat trail by 17. Smith kicks to Hero. Outside Butler. Smith against Tatum. Unloads from 13. And Boston with the rebound. Pass to Brown. Williams against Smith. 
Williams gets the bucket. Oh, showing that aggressive nature. Williams competes hard, doesn't back down, and he'll let his opponent know he's not afraid of the contact. Now, Hero. Outside Butler. Has to auto buy. Back to Butler. Just five on the clock. Over Tatum. They get the rebound. And the rebound paying Jimmy off as they pick up Butler. two on the second chance bucket right there. Such a rugged player. If you forget where Butler is, he's going to hit the boards hard. Outside Tatum. A three. And the Celtics hit again from deep. This three-point game has been incredible tonight. If he comes even close to repeating his first Final. half performance, All for the it's going to be a crazy game for him. Timeout called the Heat. One of the stories here, Jason Tatum heading it done today. And he is absolutely dialed in from outside. They need to close out on him much quicker than when he's lined up those three. Well, Celtics making a switch here. Smart's checked in. Goes up off the inbound. The shot by Autobio, no good. And so Brown will bring it up for Boston. They've given up just eight points in the fourth quarter. Now you can't look at the result of that shot. They'll take that whenever they get it. You're exactly right. I mean, that's the kind of shot you're trying to work for at the offensive end. Now, Hero. Smith finds Autobio. It's over Payne. The shot by Autobio, no good. Celtics leading by 20. Brown, the pass to Payne. Back to Brown. And foul on the shot. He'll shoot two at the free throw line. Something you saw a lot from Brown as an amateur. He can draw fouls and get to the line. At the line, Jalen Brown. At the line for two shots. the first. Bruce Brown is checked in for Miami. And Brown drops them both. Miami's gotten a lot of looks from outside tonight. Five of 12. Outside Butler. Smith finds Autobio. Back to Smith. Six to shoot. Let's a floater go. Now Tatum. Brown outside. Passes it to Tatum from deep three-point range. Busted. No good that time either. And for the Heat, they're shooting 40% from the field. Outside Butler. He tries for three. And Tatum pulls it down. He's done almost no damage from three-point range in this game. No threes in this half. And only one for the first. Payne dishes to Brown. Outside Tatum. Back to Brown. Releases. He claims that one off the back line and down it falls. And it just seems that every pass they make is leading to a score. Just a great ball movement. Back to Smith. Now the pass to Autobahn. Now here's a chew. Payne covering. Solid rebound there. And with the score like it is, that's an area. They can't afford to get lazy. Here's Brown. Some solid defense from Butler. The Heat shooting in the fourth quarter down around 31%, not playing with as much energy here late. Here's Smith to end the run. And a lot of contact on that one, so he'll shoot two here. Wow, the speed of Smith, his ability to change gears constantly keeps the D on their toes. 
He has a knack for picking up fouls while shooting. Smith taking two shots. Free throw, no good. And the second free throw, good. Here's the Celtics with the ball. They're on an 11 to 3 run right now. Faden is guarded by Adebayo. Tatum, no good. And here are the Heat now. Adebayo kicks to Buck. That's it. Coming off an assist from Adebayo. The assist. Adebayo's got his sixth assist on the night. Celtics leading by 21 to the inside. Tatum gets the bucket. Tatum's got 44. And with the game he's having, there's no doubt he'll be the guy they lean on to protect the lead. Back to Smith. Wants to get it to Adebayo and does. Shoots over Brown. And he makes the bucket, gets the whistle. And now a three-point play chance here for him. That's his first. That is not a simple finish by any means. Adebayo had to keep his focus and makes the need think twice about getting physical with him. One shot. Throw good out of bio. How about during his third season? Bam out of bio took the leap, named an all star for the first time. Bam was huge in the 2020 bubble, helping the Heat reach the NBA Finals. Time call here. The Celtics decide to talk it over. And he could tell his guys were dragging a little bit, calling time out to kind of let them catch their breath. We present our New Balance Player of the Game, Ish Smith. And the way he's made his mark with his work inside, he's just been a slasher tonight. Always moving, getting to the basket at will, and just seemingly taking advantage of a D that was reluctant to get in his way. Payne covered by Smith. Brown the pass to Payne. Miami grabs the miss. Smith's got five rebounds tonight. Now he hasn't chipped in with many points tonight. The good thing he has the guys around him to carry the weight. Pass to Achua. Pass and it's Smith Perfect. with the assist that time. And, and just a step ahead of the D in that possession there making the pass nice assist now here's Payne tight defense on him outside Tatum over Butler Boston no good that time either the Heat trail by 18 the drive by Smith and he uses the glass on the way oh you better respect the lightning speed of Smith jetting towards the basket with this insane quickness Faden, he's guarded by Adebayo. That's tipped. Here's Brown. And yep, that, that's going to be a flagrant foul. Unnecessary contact. Boy, a, a very hard foul that time. And the official shot had to slap him with the flagrant. I mean, you can't let him get away with that kind of contact. Yeah, gee, that's an easy call for the officials to make when there's that much contact. The league is really cracking down on those sort of plays. And he knocks down the first one. Oh. 
so he hits one of two from the strike. Attack. And, and it's not about running up the score, it's about closing the door or any kind of coming. And the Heat all time here. They're down by 17. 132 left in the game. And the Heat going with the whole new group on the floor. 132 left here in the fourth quarter. A step back shot here. You can't get it to go. So the Sonics will take it the other way. And guys, that's going to wrap it up. Fans are piling out the exits. Obviously a huge win here in game two for the Celtics. When you shoot this well from three-point range, you're really hard to stop. The defense didn't rotate out fast enough to stop the hot shooter. Yeah, exactly, Kevin. They were lethal from deep. And this win has really got to feel fantastic, guys. It evens up the series now at one game apiece. Yeah, I mean, it's a whole new series now. But best of five, if you will. You never want to lose two to start this thing off. But right now, they've got something to be happy about going into game three. And when you look back at this one, what an amazing performance this was for Jason Tatum. I mean, he had a plan for how to attack the deep. He executed and never let up. Relentless offensive basketball. Now, here's Langford. Tatum finds Edwards. Here's Langford. And the rebound goes to Murphy. Rivers against Edwards. Now here's Rivers. Pass to Mann. Over Horford. No good. Oh, it's such a disciplined defender. I mean, Horford with the ability to get to the right spot and put his side to you. And so it's Boston easily grabbing this one. Just a massive victory, Greg. Maybe it's overstating it, but I think this was a game they had to have. And I don't think it's overstating it. I agree with you. I mean, going down 2-0 would have given this team a huge hill to climb. But now at one game apiece and with some momentum, this is anybody's series. And now let's catch up with David Aldridge, who's standing by from the sideline. All right, Dave. Thanks very much, Al. You guys do it as a five-man unit on the floor. How did you come together for this win? Uh, just taking good shots on offense, um, trying to, you know, getting stops on defense. Uh, we challenged every shot. Um, you know, we just, just played hard tonight. Great effort and a big win, Al. Congrats. Back to you, Kevin. All right, David, thank you. And that about wraps it up for this broadcast of the NBA Eastern Conference quarterfinals. For Chris Weber, Craig Anthony, and David Olden, this is Kevin Harlan. Thank you for being with us. See you next time.